My name is Jimmy, his name is Jake, and this is the Weekly Dumb. Jake, how goes it? Jim, Zach, Richard, uh, good. Good weekend. First snow, not a real snow. Well, actually, some places in the northeast. Real snow not for the, us. Not the city. Uh, two inches, you're going to count that as a real snow for you? Ooh, I said three inches. I changed it. I had to shovel my driveway. You're dri- up to three. I had to shovel my driveway, okay. the sidewalk. We Three's made a snowman, good. Two's snowball fight. It was heavy snow. Alda Snow, John Snow, heavy snow. Brittany Snow. She's good. Sarah Snow, friend of mine. That's a friend of yours. She got married. And she loves sports. She does. Right? She does. I think she, yeah, she does. Football she, probably. She sent me a Facebook message about this Raymil Tapia. Three, two, two one, one, six point one. Yeah. It's a it's lot, like but nice, it's good. But yeah. He hits an electric, the old Little League bunt home run, Zach, in the Dominican Winter League. And Jim, there's obviously anytime this happens, there's a lot to like. But what did you like, man? Uh, I liked how old the catcher was. And yeah, that's kind of it. I mean, you've seen you, you see you see a you lot of errors a lot. There, but. I just so if I get a jump straight at the end. The catcher's so old. Right. I tried to find out who he was. I couldn't. And I also liked the umpire called him out. And then they were just like, nah. Like everyone was like, nah, ball's out. Ball's sitting on the ground. Ball's not in in his glove. Decent recovery by the ump because a lot of umps would go panic mode there and go like, big, he's safe. And he sees the ball and he just goes, okay. I was wrong. Can I tell you something I like about Rimmel Tapia in this situation? Yeah. He has a bunt home run. And in the big leagues last year or two years ago, he has a grand slam fly ball. It was at Fenway. The center fielder just lost it. He runs. So sometimes you create your own luck, man. He so runs fast. Free homers. Jim, this almost a breakdown you were telling me about. A, was big on the internet, and B, we have a hella good segue, Cali. Yeah, this one, we're going to go to the courtroom. Convicted felon, <laughs> Deobra Redden. How do you think you pronounce that first name? Do- Dobra? Debra. It's a male, though. Yeah. Three-time felon convicted of battery a lot of times because he beats people up. He's getting his uh, sentencing, and the judge goes, uh-uh, with that history, I'm going to change it up. I just can't with that history. And he doesn't even let her finish. He just jumps and is like, oh, yeah. battered. He gets the judge. Pretty impressive jump. And then there's a skirmish. And then what I like is the one dude realizes it's a lot it's okay for him to punch right now and so he throws one punch and he's just kind of like and then he just throws a million punches they don't do much yeah for me i guess the only disappointment about this is like a courtroom and where the security is you assume it's set up that if this scenario happens because he said our guy deborah redden yeah said he was having a bad day and that's why he did it yeah so you assume it's set up because a lot of people in that situation are having a bad day uh, I wanted the defense to get there a half second earlier. And, it, you know, it's a good double down. Battery? I'll show you battery. I'll show you my batteries. Uh. And let's go to DraftKings. Place your bets. Football playoffs anyways. I bet the drilling doesn't stop. Jim, we had a nice non-roughing the kicker in the Giants game. A hugging the kicker. It's a rough hug. It's a rough the, hug. Uh, the kicker does not go down. I like, uh, this is an all-timer. You know, if this was the the 80s, this would be on the VHS, like, bloopers of the yes. NFL, and they'd put a soundtrack to it and make it like a cartoon. Whacked out sports. I wish it was mic'd up, because I want to hear, like, the kicker probably wouldn't say anything, but the dude, I'd be like, come on, dude. Come on. Get up. Kicker's just kind of going limp on him. Well, in the rules, it said for roughing the kicker, the kicker has to touch the ground. So by holding him up, yeah. he's good. So they're going to have to change this. Otherwise, players are going to do this all the time and start torturing punters. What if you just like push a dude into one of your teammates who who catches his fall? I mean, feels like roughing, right? Feels th- This, this felt, felt like roughing. This felt more than just a, like a nice shove. Like Red I'd, roughing. Yes. Sarah Snow, your friend. Yes. Two names, Zach. And if you put them together? Sarah Snuffing. Lord Voldemort. (gasps) And was there a not sports? You said you were involved in this situation? Not involved. Not involved. My meter just went off. (laughs) So, Dwayne Waden. Three, two, one. 2.5. I kind of like that. You like it? Yeah, because it's got alliteration in the middle, like Dwayne Way. If he pronounces it Dwayne... Then it's a good Southern name. Dwayne Dwayne Wayden. Well, he's a pastor at the Elevated Life International Ministries and also is a semi-truck driver. His wife is in management training at the McDonald's. And what happened here was she was getting picked on by her coworkers. 
Um, and she called her husband and said, hey. They're picking on me. So the husband promptly drove his truck to the McDonald's, stormed in, grabbed the employee by the throat, and pushed his face into the deep fryer just close enough. Just close enough to let the guy know, I could deep fry your face. Instead, then took him away from the deep fryer, punched him a whole bunch, and beat him up. Now, my question for you, Jake. Yes. For all of the members of the Elevated Life International Ministries, are they appalled by this behavior or are they clapping for Pastor Waden saying that's how we protect our own? They're clapping for They're clapping. Pastor Waden. They're I definitely, mean, okay. Is, you know, I, so you've been Elevated Life International. For me, the big thing here is, uh, and we've got a nice little connect the dot here, uh, Dwayne Waden, yeah. 57 years old. The way you just said his name, that's a good name. Dwayne Waden? His wife... Is 44, 57, 44. The employee is 34, our age. 57 to 34, <laughs> put to the fryer, bro. That's a bad day. Yeah. Maybe it trades him out, though. And maybe he joins his church. Employee of the week. Do, 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 leader do, do, in the clubhouse for me. Employee of the week. Right there. Did anyone do shit last week? Sam oversaw our council for guts maybe the ball talking ball maybe sam and the ball we'll make we'll take a picture of both of them together today that'd be nice we'll just say sam can you hold this ball and she won't know what it's for yeah and then because it'll show up and then it'll be a picture forever call her call her sam mo tasky sam mo tasky wins employee of the week and the ball sam and the ball Zach, that's on you there's sam and a ball in my hands that was a weekly dumb Today's episode of the Weekly Dumb was brought to you by DraftKings. The National Football League playoffs are here, and we've teamed up with DraftKings, an official partner of the NFL, who's kicking things off with a huge offer. Throughout the playoffs, all new customers will get $200 in bonus bets instantly when they place their first $5 wager on anything. So download the DraftKings Sportsbook app and use promo code WEEKLY. 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 When you do. That's how Pastor Waiting gets members. <laughs> Beats them to an inch of their life. <laughs> no. Says, uh, why don't you come hang out with me? Ooh. <laughs> elevated life. Have an Sign elevated up. life. Like that dude found a business card in his pocket afterwards. Like, what the fuck? Elevated life. That'd be cool. Shows up. That'd actually be And sick. he's the pastor? Yeah. Wow. That's a good that's a good episode one scene. Well, it ends. That's the end of the episode when he shows up and he sees that he's yeah. the pastor. Yeah. I want to watch the show. <laughs>